Hey guys, this is Kay here. Just wanted to um, cut this quick video. Yes, I am in the car driving, um, headed to meet some some coworkers of mine, and um, I wanted to cut this quick video to share something with you. Um, you know, one thing I've experienced in the past several years is that. Um, sometimes you may find yourself in a fork in a road where you have to go left or right and um, sometimes we can be in, in a situation where you know that situation is just comfy and cozy I'll give you an example you know let's say you started this job making great money everything's doing lovely you know you're getting bonuses and you're getting promoted and you got your nice cubicle or your office and it's like life couldn't seem like it couldn't get any better and then one day or just over a period of time you started to experience some uncomfortable uncomfortable I can't, I can't say the word but you start to feel uncomfortable basically is what I'm trying to say and you see a lot of changes going on you know a lot of changes around you and that comfy feeling that you felt you no longer feel that you're starting to feel stressed out you know you're working on these long hours you're putting all this extra you know all this time in and they're paying you they're paying you well but you are stressed out you're stressed out to the max and you know if you were like if you're like how I was you you have a long commute to work taking the kids to school you know taking about an hour and a half to get to work an hour and a half to come back home and over time, that can really drain you. And it can really just just take the life out of you. Where you get to a point where you're just frustrated. It's like, is it all worth it? You know, is this all this money that I'm getting paid? Is it worth my help? You know, is it worth me being so stressed out? And I got to that point where I was like, I was so stressed out. I didn't know what to do. And, um, you know, I started applying for jobs and so forth. But the point that I wanted to make is that, you know, we all come to that point in our life where we're forced to reevaluate where we are in our lives. And having, you know, you get to a point where you have to really say, do I want to stay on this path or do I want to see what my options are? And we always have options. You know, I had options. We always have options. Never think that, you know, you're stuck in that particular situation. A lot of us think, you know, well, I've gotten this, this comfortable lifestyle and so I need this job. I need this job with a salary, you know, to pay all these expenses and overhead that I have. But I tell you, you have to look and say, is it worth it? Is your health worth you getting, starting to get sick and, you know, just dealing with that whole thing of, of being all stressed out? Sometimes you have to, you have to make sacrifices. And I tell you, I made a sacrifice a couple, about a year ago. And um, I made a sacrifice. I took another job and I'm working from home and it does not have all the perks that the other job has. But I'm telling you, I have such, I have a more of a less stressed type of position. I still work and I, you know, I, I work my butt off, but it's not as stressful and I have the flexibility. And, um, you know, even though I work from home, I still have that desire to own my own business five, six, seven years from now. And I'm doing right now what it takes to get myself, position myself so that I can work for myself, be at home, and live the life of freedom that I desire. And it is very possible. It is very possible. But you have to make a decision in your mind and say, this is what I want. This is what I'm going to work toward. And it can be difficult, especially when you're working a job and you're having to commit to, to your own thing at nighttime and you're dead tired but if it's something that you really want you'll you'll make the will make the way to do it you'll persevere through it and I'm doing it and um, I know it's going to be well worth it it'll be well worth it and um, but I, you know I just have that entrepreneurial spirit in me and I know a lot of ladies and, and men out there are in the same situation that I'm in they're working a job but they wish that they can do their own thing and it's not like they hate their job or anything. They just want to be able to have that 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 full freedom, financial freedom, time freedom. And so I just wanted to share that with you that we all, you know, come to that fork in the road and, and reevaluate where we're at and um, have to, to make a decision. And I know I made that decision. So hopefully this message will 
resonate with someone out there that's probably going through it or went through it and if so feel free to to leave a comment you know if you've been through it or going through it and you know needing to make those hard decisions and sacrificing money over um, wanting more time with your kids and wanting to be at home just feel free to, to share a comment you know we, we're here to help each other so hopefully I've, I've helped someone else if they're in that situation also um, jump over to my Facebook fan page where uh, breaking breaking barriers to freedom and I'm always posting tips and motivational um, advice and um, all type of stuff and then different opportunities so feel free to jump over there and, and, and leave me a comment and like my page so um, also if you're looking for an opportunity where you you know you're looking for something where you can work from home um, or make passive income while you're still working your full-time job I would like to invite you to my page uh, which is www.iwantalifeandgetpaid.com and check out my free video there and see if that's something that would interest you so anyhow on my way to meeting my friends my co-workers so I will talk to you later bye